Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Amen. Nataka nichukue nafasi hii niwashukuru ninyi nyote kwa kufika hapa katika chapel hii katika residence ya naibu rais um, wa taifa letu la Kenya karibuni sana um, nataka nimshukuru eh, ndugu yetu Kisotu kwa kutunenea neno la Mungu na sote tumefurahi ya kwamba tumepata nafasi hii ya kipekee tuweze kushiriki ibada leo katika eh, chapel hii um, nataka pia niwashukuru ninyi nyote na pia eh, niwashukuru wale wote ambao wametembea pamoja na sisi eh, watu wengi eh, wamekuwa pengine wakishangaa mbona mimi eh, pande zote mbele na nyuma kulia na kushoto ni mambo ya Mungu. Nafikiri mumeona mama wangu. <laughs> e, ni mtu wako niombea. E, sister yangu ambaye mimi namfuata. Huyo hapo anaitwa Elizabeth ni pasta. Na, na mke wangu pia ni prayer warrior. So mimi, mimi sina mimi sina mahali ya kujificha na neno la Mungu. Pande sote. Eh, so wale wanakathirika na mimi saa zingine na mambo ya Mungu watanisamehe tu kwa sababu <laughs> kwa sababu ndio hali. Ni ndio hali yangu ndio hiyo. Eh, I really have nowhere to hide. Kwa mambo ya Mungu eh, I'm surrounded by very prayerful people. And that's why I think many a times uh, some people concerned about my relationship with God. Um, some even accuse me sometimes of being too much Christian. But that is uh, how things are. Nataka pia niwashukuru ninyi nyote na nichukue nafasi hii. Niwashukuru wa Kenya wote. Hii ni Jumapili yetu ya kwanza tangu tuende katika uchaguzi mkuu wa taifa letu la Kenya. Nataka niwashukuru wa Kenya wote mamilioni nafikiri milioni kumi na ine ikiongezeka waliojitokeza ili kupiga kura e, tuwe na nafasi ya kuchagua viongozi wetu e, wa miaka mitano inayokuja. Nataka niwapongeze wote mlio jitokeza mapema na wote waliopiga kura nataka pia niwapongeze viongozi wote waliochaguliwa katika taifa letu la Kenya um, neno la Mungu linatufundisha katika methali 16 mstari wa 33 kwamba kura upigwa ili kujua nini itatokezea lakini uamuzi inatoka kwa Mungu so much as we all went to vote the decision the final decision is God's so um, i want to thank all Kenyans who um, came forward to vote on the 9th of August so that we can choose the leaders of our nation for the next five years. And I also want to celebrate all the leaders elected in all the parties. Uh, because as I said, we vote, but God chooses. And every leader who has been chosen uh, in that election there is a purpose for which God has allowed all the leaders who have chosen who have been who have been voted for and God has chosen God has a purpose for our country um, I want to request and ask all of us as uh, the people of Kenya to be patient uh, with the processes that are going on um, at 
the moment and to pray for the rest of uh, IBC so that they can um, complete this exercise in uh, the manner in which we have voted. We've had a peaceful uh, uh, election moment. We've voted peacefully. We have gone through this process peacefully. And it's my prayer that we end this process peacefully. Because Biblia uh, inasema, Mwisho wa jambo ni bora kuliko mwanzo. So tunaomba Mungu iwe hivyo kwamba mwisho wa hili jambo tulilo nalo litakuwa bora kuliko vile tulivyoanza. So nataka niwaulize wote eh, ndugu zetu wa Kenya eh, kutoka sehemu zote za taifa letu la Kenya um, wawe wa, na utulivu na uvumilivu ili tuweze kuwapatia wale ambao wanatusaidia kukamilisha mambo ya eh, kutafuta viongozi wa taifa letu la Kenya nafasi ya kutimiza wajibu wao na vile tumefanya uchaguzi huu kwa amani na kwa kuelewana na kila mtu kujitolea ningeomba ya kwamba hata wakati tunakamilisha tukamilishe katika hali hiyo ya amani na kuelewana na tuendelee mbele kama taifa sote tukisherehekea uraia wetu kama watu wa taifa letu la Kenya um, and, and to all of us as i have said we celebrate all our leaders that have been elected so far and we want to wait patiently peacefully for the next few um, uh, moments as we wait for the conclusion of the election process. I want to ask every Kenyan, wherever we are, to know that yes, we have voted, but it is God who chooses. And uh, we will have the leaders that will take our country uh, to the next level. So, Asanteni Sana. Uh, to all of you who have come uh, this uh, this morning and afternoon for this service, we wish you well, everybody, each and every, each, each and every one of us. Um, and uh, I want to thank uh, uh, members of my family and my friends who made it to this service, uh, and we look forward to better moments ahead. Mm -hmm. So Asanteni Sana, I think I will conclude by requesting uh, Pastor Dokas to come and say the final prayer. Um, as uh, somebody has predicted, maybe she, she will take over as the pastor here. <laughs>